Katz has won a couple of titles. She gets a little shaky on serve. <laughs> Panetta has such great court sense, and her favorite service is actually a certain 17-year-old that's been doing that well here. Melanie Uden plays tomorrow night. Sina just snap her. This match started, and I asked her, where are you going? She's like, I gotta get used to the lights. I just had a light hit earlier today. Now is my real hit. Wow. <laughs> All those three setters, and she's doing two days in the practice court. That's beautifully done by Panetta. This is what Mary Jo is talking about. Very opportunistic. Could see that Serena Williams was like two millimeters from the net. Decent return, but Panetta moves so quickly. Mary Jo, you have that one? Almost. It's such a huge advantage, the weapon that Serena possesses. Okay. 114 miles per hour for that. Ace up the middle, her third nearly going. It's to us. Imagine that. Can get you into trouble, too. You better say nice things, Pam. It's hard for me sometimes, but... Serena's been returning so well, so opponents have to go for a bit. And don't give Serena the angles. He said he was concerned about the running forehand. He thinks that Serena hits her forehand the best when she's on the run. It is a tactic we've seen effective at times against Serena, isn't it, Pam, that... That's a well-thought-out point. Johan Santana was here last night, so the Mets are represented, the next Mets. Talk about a great power player, Young and his... Bounza trying to force a tie break. Keep a close eye on that. Mm. Five with clutch winners. Point on their first serve. Mm. That might be worth a challenge, but Panetta satisfied it did kick. Well done, a one handed backhand flick behind Panetta. Toronto and Cincinnati. In Cincinnati, Safina gave her just two games in that semifinal. Now that's a big miss. Opportunity to open up the court. Panetta has done a beautiful. They know their tennis down under. In the south. Serena in this set. It's only been five points on each player against their own serve. 
Just an old grass match between two guys. Terrible finding first serves. She wears you down, Serena. <laughs> Person for about 12 seconds. Serena Williams. Serena is just on full charge, straight for the net. Sets up a pretty easy lob. Is she one of the top lobbers in women's tennis? I'll tell you, it's a shot. I heard somebody today, another one of our great teammates, say that the lob's not used enough. It's actually during the Bryan Brothers' double. Wow. Net it. Absolutely. Absolutely huge forehand. Big point early in the set. Yes. Lucky for Serena. Let the tape pop straight up. returns of the match for Panetta. We call Pam and she shouts after that serve of perfect so far tonight. start to whittle down a bit starting today. That's well hit. It does get shaky. We saw it in the semis of Wimbledon have some breakdown moments. Orion stayed steady there. Other aspects. Embracing things like the drop shot, which Roger never really enjoyed. Not pretty. When you don't have a plan B, it can get pretty ugly out there. But that should be planning. Just relax. 
relentless hitting until Panetta finally. And having Murray lost, it's even more grateful that Nadal and Federer are on the opposite halves. Tournaments over, it's back to Italy to rest. Make the most of it. Wow, just bludgeoned. 79 miles. Malfis and Nadal coming up next here as Panetta serves to stay in it. It's low 15. <laughs> Another lob that wins the point for Panetta. Solid effort so far tonight. She'd bring that out later. Gambling and tennis? No. Man. Oh, no. That's just as good as an ace. 118 miles. For it again? No. Gets tight. Slice. Exchange. We know Panetta can fight Pam. We've seen it before from her. She left nothing out there, but it wasn't her control. Serena storms on to the semis. Who can stop her? I don't think anybody. The mom, super mom, Kim Pleiser certainly has a chance. But don't you love when the best point of the match is the last point? And that reaction for Serena to win a routine quarterfinal four and three was beautiful at the end. That shows you. Mary Joe Fernandez. Serena, great effort. What about that last point? <laughs> you know, she was down, seven, I think, seven match points in her last match, and I knew that I had to win because she never gives up. She's such a good player and gave such a great match tonight. You guys were going toe-to-toe -to -toe in the first set, on serve, no break points. What was the turning point for you to break open this match? Well, I think just my experience, you know, she was serving, and I just felt like I had nothing to lose, and, you know, just go for it. 
Well, you served extremely well. How much confidence does the serve give you when you're playing a player who's defending so well? Um, it gives me a lot of confidence because she had great returns, and for me to serve, you know, pretty good, it felt good. Pretty good. I would say it was outstanding. Okay, let's look ahead. Another semifinal, a familiar opponent, the comeback player at this tournament, Kim Kleisters. What do you remember most about your matchups? Well, um, you know, I just, she's such a great person, and I uh, only wish the best for her, obviously, but not in my next match. But, you know, regardless, <laughs> regardless, it'll be a great match. Um, she has nothing, you know, to lose, and she's just having so much fun, and I, it makes me see how much she enjoys the game. It makes me really happy. Are you surprised at how quickly she's come back? This is only her third tournament. Um, initially I was, but then once she did so well a couple weeks ago, I knew that she was someone to watch out for. All right, well, well done tonight. Good luck in the semifinals. Serena Williams hasn't dropped a set yet, Chris. No, she hasn't.